Kia ora koutou katoa. I just want to give a plug for the NZ COVID Tracer app. This is an app that we've designed to help New Zealanders keep a track of where they've been and it's going to be a really important tool in helping us do really rapid contact tracing should we need to if or when we get COVID-19 back in the community. Every time you go into a store or a cafe or somewhere that has the QR code, just scan it. It really only takes a couple of seconds. I'm doing it every day. The key point about this is it's quite hard to remember what you were doing even yesterday, let alone a couple of weeks ago. And if we need to find out from you that where you've been so that we can trace possible contacts, it's really helpful if we've got a record of where you have been. I just want to say that your record remains private and on your phone. That information is yours and you only share it with us if you want to. The only information we keep here at the Ministry, and it doesn't go anywhere else, is your registration information and that's so we can contact you rapidly should we need to if we've got cases of COVID-19 in the community. So when you go into a store or a cafe or somewhere that has the QR code for the NZ COVID Tracer app, I'm just going to show you what that QR code looks like. You might see more than one QR code. This is the one you're looking for. It talks about the NZ COVID Tracer app. It has the Ministry of Health logo at the bottom and it has the Unite Against COVID logo. So that's the QR code you look for. Go in, open up the app, scan it, it automatically registers it there. And after 30 days, the information is deleted off your phone. So it only keeps that record for 30 days. Recently, we've added a new function to the app and that allows you to input data manually. So for example, if you go to a cafe or a business and there isn't a QR code there, or if you go to other places that wouldn't normally have a QR code, you can also add that in so you can keep a really complete record of where you've been and your movements for the last 30 days. And again, that's incredibly helpful for our contact tracing.